News broke on Wednesday evening that five-star Berkeley prep edge rusher Keon Keeley would be decommitting from the Notre Dame Fighting Irish. On three has him ranked as the number three overall player and number one edge in America. You see the on three consensus, number 11 overall player, number one edge. Um, obviously a huge loss for the Fighting Irish. Here is what Keeley said in his announcement about the news. First and foremost, I would like to thank the University of Notre Dame and their tremendous staff for spending the time to recruit me to Notre Dame. I'm truly grateful for the opportunity. Making a decision that will ultimately affect my life's path has been quite the challenging and cannot be understated. With that said, I will be decommitting from the University of Notre Dame. I hope everyone understands my need to ensure I find the right path. So, folks, uh, it, it really it's a stinger for Notre Dame. Um, obviously, was the highest ranked recruit in Notre Dame's class, and they will look to now fill the spot um, that is left by Keeley. Notre Dame's offered three players since the end of July when Keeley started to uh, seriously waver in his pledge, at least it became very apparent, uh, visited Alabama at the end of July. Notre Dame offered Caleb Herring, who's committed to Tennessee, but Notre Dame's looking to make a move and flip him. Blake Purchase um, from Englewood, Colorado, Cherry Creek. You see he's leaning towards Oregon, but what's interesting here is that Jaden Moore um, a edge rusher from California. He committed to Oregon just Wednesday night. Not sure what Oregon's um, edge rusher weak side end spots look like, but Oregon went ahead and picked up an, a commitment from Moore on Wednesday. Notre Dame actually offered more on Monday, so we do expect Notre Dame to continue to recruit more despite his commitment, and then you do have Blake Purchase, who Notre Dame will recruit. So again, folks, it's it's not good news here for the Irish losing Keon Keeley. Visited Alabama a couple times. Rumors out there he's going to officially visit Ohio State. I would expect him to uh, take officials to several other schools. You know, Notre Dame certainly seems out of the race now, and they will move on to other prospects. So uh, for more information on this news, make sure you head over to blueandgold.com. We already have articles up on the news as well as what's next for Notre Dame following Keon Keeley's deep commitment and some kind of nuggets on how this came together. Sign up to the site one dollar for one year of premium access the deal of the century is still going on so make sure you head to blueandgold.com check out the articles hit the thumbs up on this video subscribe to our channel if you have not yet and we'll catch you next time